Okay, here we are. We're getting evolved into this project. Got some film in there. I haven't run anything yet. I've got an issue with my my motor. It's a three-phase motor. It's a 240. I'm running it at 240 volt. Um, but the variable frequency drive that I'm trying to use on it doesn't seem to be cooperating. So I'm working on that. But it does run. I've had the motor running. It's just not running properly. So let's go over what we've been doing. We've got the turret reassembled, rewired it for, rewired the solenoid and the turret motor to operate. And do that remotely on the timer relays. We have got our failsafe put in, installed. And along with that, we have bottom takeout arm to guide the film out. And I think that's probably, oh, we got the, uh, got the framing lamp put back together and the back end put back together with the uh, shutter guard. Dowser solenoid is in place and all the covers are back on. So that's been reassembled. Got the cover on for the flywheel and the take up or the sound drum. And we've got most of the wiring reestablished for all the components on here. coming down from the turret motor Put the wiring up for the main motor and all the wiring culminates in the back in here comes out through the bottom and there's all my leads getting to, ready to attach all this stuff I replaced the oil filler tube here's the old one it was just like it's hard it's like I can't even hardly bend that and I put a nice fresh one in here. It's nice PVC, and I made a. Get this out of here. There we are. I made a end cap plug for it with a nylon filler cap plug, and refilled my intermittent with fresh oil. Put all that back. Okay. We've got a stand. We've got a pedestal. It's sitting upright on its intended base now, as you can see. Um, still working on this. We still have more pieces to add to this, but we're getting there. We've got most of it. The main part of the steel has been constructed, but we're still adding little plates, and i got to add a junction box at the back at the bottom down there. And... The upper plate mount where this is going to go. This is where the uh, the variable frequency drive is going to mount. And we also have take up stand done, mostly done. I have to mount a roller here and a roller here, but it's pretty much done. Scored the motor and the upper clutch spindle from a guy on eBay. Paid dearly for it, of course. But it was that was a piece that was a little tricky to find. And the upper spindle is not matching the lower spindle. Because the lower spindle has a different flip over knob than the upper spindle. So although it's not matched, I don't care. It still is totally functional. And um, right now we're sort of working on these two rollers to get this finished off and yeah so let's see other than that we have our Dolby gear rack getting there I'm gonna put a wood top on it I got some metal panel sides to put on I'm gonna put a wood bottom on the inside but for the most, for the most part eek, it's pretty much done so yeah, YouTube, 
we've been continuing to be busy and we are going to continue to be more busy as we crank this puppy out. And as always, thanks for watching.